Hello everyone! Welcome back to this game! So, you know another thing that I like about returning to regular Let's Plays? Getting these recordings started is so simple. I don't have to worry about announcing a stream and setting it up. I can just open the stuff, hit record. Here we are. Anyway, I am hyped because we are about to finish the first dungeon. We have finished the first dungeon. Clinch. Huh? The door is locked. Oh, that's a door. I, I kind of thought I was stepping onto some sort of teleporter or something. Kind of think of it, yeah, there were... There was a mention early on of there being random doors. I guess we're seeing that in action. Are we going to be going through various doors throughout this world? Either way, new location. Neat. Anyway, doors locked as I suspected. She doesn't seem very surprised at all. Is it common for this kind of thing to happen in this world? There's a puzzle blocking our path. We need to solve it if we want to continue. B puzzle? Yes, a magical puzzle. That doesn't answer my question very well. Who the hell makes these puzzles? The evil spirits like to play pranks on passerby. Or passers by. They find it funny to see travelers not being able to solve puzzles. That's... That's actually kind of cute. Like, I can just imagine a bunch of ghosts hiding in the corner, just giggling as they watch people solve puzzles. In some cases, they make impossible puzzles out of pure sadism. Okay, that is not so cute. Im impossible? When this happens, you will be stuck in the same place for a long time. And... What if this puzzle is something like this? Are we going to get stuck? Possibly. Possibly? But don't worry, there's only one way to find out. We have to try to solve it, right? Um... We have no other option. Fine. Welcome to the laser puzzle. Okay, hold on. I need to get rid of this window that has popped up. Yes, Avast. I know I'm being tracked. Please stop tracking me. Anyway, welcome to the laser puzzle. If you see this type of puzzle blocking your path, don't worry. It's very simple. Just draw lines using the laser mirrors. If you turn them in the right direction, south, east, west, or north, they will fire a beam of light. They are magic mirrors that create their light. There's a pattern you need to follow to do this. Take a close look, and it will be clear. Also, your lines must end up connecting to a blue dot to solve the puzzle. You may learn how the puzzle works through trial and error, so good luck. And the song is Unknown Wonders. And now we know. Oh, I can't interact with that. Just a mirror to... I find it interesting that it faced us while we were talking to it. Okay, I was wondering how to get these things to activate. Oh, there's even more of them down there. Hey, you! I saw you before. Are you the same one from before? Yes. Yan. Are you a person who donated beyond the recommended price? Bunny Kid! I came here to find my basketball, but I can't get out anymore. 
This puzzle is very difficult. You think we'll actually come across an impossible puzzle? As I perform air quotes that you can't see? I mean, according to lore, that's entirely possible, but... It would be kind of frustrating if we actually encountered an impossible puzzle in gameplay. Anyway, this puzzle, not impossible. I should miss to here to... East? Oh, I also do this one. It would be a little bit better if the action of turning this, these mirrors were a little quicker. Like, going through this menu, and then I choose north, and then it just happens, rather than telling me about it. Considering the brightness, I say we got it. Oh, it's dimming. But we still got it. Yep, I think it's unlocked. Yahoo! You did it! I'm so proud of you. You're getting used to this place well for someone who's just arrived. Thank you, but... I don't think getting used to a place like this is a good thing. <laughs> you know what is a good thing? I'm feeling so much better. The first few episodes, I was still... having some lingering effects of the cold, but... I don't know if you could tell, but... I am so much more optimistic today. I feel great. Uh, again? Those mischief li little ghosts were on fire today. Yeah, I can see. <laughs> Cheer up, Elise. Which is how we pronounce your name. I found that out. Hopefully, I don't forget to pronounce it that way. We will reach the end of these puzzles soon. I hope so. What do you mean, you hope? And why am I stuttering in my thoughts? Did you see the cardboard cutout I left in the chess area? He's nice, isn't he? Oh, kind of think of it. That cardboard cutout wasn't animated. Save Rabbit. Hello! I'm the Save Rabbit. My job is to remind you to save your game. Eh, uh, alright. I, I guess I can do that. I'll save right here today. So, were you always a rabbit, or did you become a rabbit whenever you wound up here in... Soul World? The World of Death? It's gone by a couple of names so far. Here's another castle. Have you ever realized how dangerous pineapples are? They literally have thorns. It has been a long time since I've had a pineapple upside down cake. They are amazing. Not as amazing as I'm making you think, but they are definitely amazing. Okay, how is this going to work, I wonder? Well, the goal is in the middle. Where's the starting point? Well, only one way to find out. Actually, it would be funny if I could just go through the door now. Nope, not even interactive. Alright, we'll just turn this to the right. And nothing happened. How about north? Okay. Well, only real and real option with these other two mirrors. And then west.
Right, let's go. Pan? What are you waiting for? Oh, sorry. I just got distracted. Pan? Are you okay? We don't have time to enjoy the landscape. Sai may be in danger while we are standing here. Sorry, when we were fighting the ghost, I got... She showed me a huge wound in her chest. Ah! We need to find a doctor. Where's the nearest hospital? <laughs> Calm down, sweetie. What? How? I mean, you're dead, but... Yes, I'm dead, but if my soul suffers enough damage, I will collapse. It didn't even occur to me... That she's a ghost, therefore how would she get KO'd? But then again, we have been fighting ghosts and making them KO'd, so... What? Shh. If you keep panicking, I won't be able to complete my healing spell. A healing spell? Remember I told you that soul power could grant special abilities? Well, my specialty is healing. Or should I say, spell shitty? Specialty. The joke works better whenever I don't stumble over the word. I wish I had the specialty to go back in time to erase the moment I thought of that pun. I wonder if anybody does have that specialty. Uh, healing powers? So does that mean you can heal your wounds whenever you want? Of course not! I still have my limitations. Anyway, sit still. This injury is huge, so maybe it will take a while. Yeah, hopefully we don't undergo that kind of damage. Reluctantly and worried about Psy, I sat on the ground as I stared at Pan, carefully healing her wound. So... How did you and your friend get to meet each other? According to what you said, you two look close to each other, so I'm curious. We... That was a long time ago. It's hard to remember. However, it only took a little effort to remember that day. Suddenly, different screen. Would have expected a transitional effect. Thank you so much for protecting me from those girls. If it wasn't for your help, I... Chill. We couldn't let those bullies do whatever they wanted to you. If they dare to mess with you again, just call us and we'll make them regret it. You are so sweet. I wish I had friends like you. Huh? But you have. I have? Um, we. You? You want to be friends with someone like me? Of course. We will be the best trio the world has ever seen. I'm very curious about this trio, considering a third person was never mentioned before this point. I'm sure we'll be meeting this third person at some point. They may, might turn out to be evil or something. And we even have a surprise for you! I showed her a necklace with a yellow stone I had in my pocket. Speaking of stones, I just noticed the pennant that Elise is wearing here. 
That pennant is also in the opening for the game. What is this? It's the friendship necklace. We both have one, and we were saving this one for the day we found someone who deserved it. It seems that day has finally come. I placed the necklace in the girl's hand with a smile on my face. Sob. Sniff. Uh. Hey! You don't need to cry. Those bullies aren't here anymore. I know. It's just that I'm really happy. I've never had real friends. Sob. Hey, speaking of which... We haven't introduced ourselves yet. How could I forget? <laughs> My name is Elise. How about yours? Sigh. And what's your name, g girl with blue hair? It occurs to me this was about meeting Sai, and this is Sai. So, a lace and... Question marks. Well, not question marks. This was question marks. But this is also a question mark because I don't know who this is. And in fact, I thought the shadow was question marks because we already know who Sai is. Yeah, like that. Cersei. Um? I couldn't hold back my tears, so I quickly used my cape to cover my expression of anguish. But that wasn't enough to hide my emotions from Pan. Sorry. I didn't know that. It's okay. Don't worry. We hugged each other for a long time, sharing tears. Tears of pain, longing, and regret. Even though we met a few minutes ago, I felt like I could trust Pan. Now that I was looking closer at her, I felt something strange. Deep inside my chest, there was a burning sensation and a feeling of familiarity, as if I had already met Pan. As if somewhere, years ago, Pan was in the same place as me. And this flame of doubt and uncertainty only grew. But I said I had not to comment on it because I doubted she knew anything that she hadn't told me yet. Right. I'm cured. Sorry for taking so long. Casting spells while wounded is not an easy task. I imagine it'll be easier in combat. Anyway, no time to lose. We need to find Sai. My tears had already dried when I remembered the purpose of our arduous journey to this point. Right. We have to find her ASAP. It makes me worry just to think that she is alone. She must be a tough girl. Sai is fine. I'm sure. Yeah. You're right. Sai may not be the strongest physically, but among us, she is the strongest psychologically. Despite everything she's been through in life, she never even thought about giving up. That's why, in her honor, I'm not going either. Let's get out of here together. It's a promise to myself. Holding Pan's hand, I led our way to the door. <laughs> 